The Corsair II was built as a light attack plane to complement the Navy's A-4 Skyhawk. Vought, which had merged with Ling Temco in 1961, won the contract by suggesting a compact, scaled-down aircraft based on the F-8. Even as A-7 deliveries to the Navy were getting underway, the Air Force was discovering that it had a need for an attack aircraft in Vietnam that could not be fully met by fighter bombers. The Air Force decided to join the Navy program and acquire the A-7s as well. The Corsair II mission in Vietnam was flown from the USS Ranger in December 1967. The A-7 proved to be a very reliable, stable performer. Out of the 12,928 missions flown in Southeast Asia, only four Corsair IIs were lost. The Corsair II is a single-seat aircraft, although 60 of them have been converted to two-seat combat-capable trainers. The aircraft's armament consists of nearly eight tons of bombs, an AGM-65 Maverick, an AGM-88 Harm missiles, or AIM-9 Sidewinder air-to-air -air missiles for self-defense. For general all-around use, Corsair IIs carry a 20mm cannon. Today, Corsair IIs remain the principal component in U.S. Navy carrier-based light attack squadrons, having replaced the A-4 Skyhawk. On the Air Force side, A-7s are used in the Air National Guard, which furnishes 70% of the nation's air defense and ground attack capability. Despite the Corsair II's age, the A-7's durability will certainly make it a valuable asset for years.